Hello friends, you must be wondering what is this big giant thing next to me? Well, if you want to know this, make sure to watch this video till the end. Let's begin. Hello friends, I am physiotherapist Meghna Rave, founder of Health Q Rehab and chief physiotherapist. And in today's video, I am going to review this wedge pillow. Yes, this thing what you are seeing in front of me is a wedge pillow. Now wedge pillow are basically defined based on their shape. If a pillow is of a triangular shape like this with a very firm base then it is called as a wedge pillow. Now this kind of pillow you will find in every physiotherapist's clinic because this is so versatile and can be used in many ways especially when we are working with patients. But if you who are someone who suffers from any sort of muscular aches and pains around your neck or its low back region or else if you have a child at home who is suffering from cerebral palsy and you have to make child do lot of activities to improve the spine function in both the scenarios this pillow is a very ideal purchase now let me clarify this this is not a sponsored video I have spent money on this and bought this and I use this in my clinic from almost more than 6 months now. So this one I have got is from a company called as Hurdu Health. I just randomly found this one in Amazon. I liked the product, the reviews were good and that's why I purchased it to be very honest. But what I would like to show in this video is not the brand thing but basically I would like to talk more about the wedge pillow. So wedge pillow as you can see has got a very firm surface. Wedge pillow has to have a firm surface so that your support stays well. The basic use of wedge pillow is to give support, additional support to the body areas where we want support to go. Right? So that's why this pillow as you can see it's very firm. It is not soft at all that my hand or thing sinks in. It, it does but it's very less. So that's the ideal pillow it should be. Now you can use it in multiple ways. There are multiple uses of this wedge. As I said wedge can be used while you are working on your bed. Yes many people especially when they are working from home they sit on the bed and walk. At that time if you put pillows behind you it might not give you a very good adequate support. But if you keep this behind your back while working from the bed or a sofa this will give a good amount of support very similarly if you who are someone who suffers from low back pain or as sciatic pain then keeping this leg under your leg keeping this pillow under your leg will make sure that you don't land up with unnecessary pain when you wake up in the morning because it positions your leg well third use is if you who are someone who have breathing issues and you can't sleep completely straight in those situations using this kind of pillow can help you because it will elevate yourself a little more and it will allow you to cough and breathe well both and if you have a child who suffers from cerebral palsy and you want to give a lot of hand weight bearing based activities then also you can make the child lie down on the tummy and then this will allow the child to play around while using the hands independently. So this were some of the uses which I mentioned. Now let me show you these uses by practical performance. So let me show you the use number one. So let's say if you have a child at home for whom you want to work on the neck control and you want her hand to be exercised or activated. With the help of this wedge you can make the child lie down on the tummy. You can keep some toys in front so the child would be encouraged to pick up the toys. This will give a good elevation and help the child to develop their neck and the shoulder muscles. Now let's move on to the use number two. Now let's say you have to walk from home and you have you are in mood of sitting on your bed and then walk. Then this pillow would be ideal for you. All you need to do is just keep this pillow fold your legs or keep them straight as you want and you can continue walking while your entire back is well supported and I can tell you how good support it gives. So 
This is one thing keep in mind doing when you are walking from home to prevent back pain. Remember I told you that if you have low back pain, you should keep this pillow on side while sleeping. How it helps, let me show you. Let's say if you have got low back pain, you need to keep your knees bent. Now, the best way of doing that is just keeping this pillow like this and then sleeping. Even if you have got cough, cold, anything, this position will make sure that you can breathe well and you will have no problem. So this is the another way you can use this pillow. The next way to use this pillow is keeping this on side of your side of you and then just keeping your legs like this. You can sleep in this way where your spine gets stretched well and when you wake up in the morning you will not have pain. And let me show you a bonus way of using this pillow. And this is one of my favorite uses. Now, whenever I'm tired throughout the day, and if I feel my back has got little stiff, then I do this. I use this pillow, sit in the Vajrasan pose like this, keep this pillow in front, and then just lie down forward like this. When I do this, my lower back pain just absolutely goes away, the stiffness goes away, and it feels so good and relaxing. I can do this very easily with the help of this pillow. So friends, this was my review about this wedge pillow. If you want to buy this pillow, the link to this pillow is mentioned in the description box. You can go and check it out. Again, I'm telling you this is not a sponsored video. So this is an absolute video which I'm sharing based on my personal experience. So make sure to try it out. Bye bye.